Good morning, everyone. Selena Pompiani here. As Pittsburgh eases back to in-person operations, like going back to the office, going out to eat and shopping, Highmark is doing big things, and they want to make sure that the community feels safe during this ongoing pandemic. It was really important to us, you know, in fulfilling our community mission uh, to work with you know, local uh, suppliers, uh, minority-owned businesses, women-owned businesses. Tom Fitzpatrick, the senior vice president of commercial market sales at Highmark, says they teamed up with four diverse Pittsburgh-based businesses to design and produce over one million cloth face coverings for members and for the community. Fashion designer Kia Tomlin has created unique designs that will be printed on the face coverings. A lot of times what we do can feel a little superficial and, and like excess. So to be able to use our um, skills and talents to do something that's needed and um, maybe things, things that other people can't do, that uh, really puts a good fulfilling element to it. The face coverings will be distributed to at-risk and vulnerable Highmark members, community organizations in need, healthcare professionals and employer groups across Pennsylvania, Delaware, and West Virginia. When it comes to the manufacturing of the face coverings, Highmark is working with CPI Creative, a woman-owned business in Aspenwall, Little Earth in the South Side, and Day Owl in Homewood. We were fortunate that um, through our connections with the R.K. Mellon Foundation, we were contacted to see if we could shift gears and produce uh, plastic face shields. Day Owl completely transitioned their operations of recycling plastic bottles and transforming them into backpacks to producing face shields and face masks. We're actually partnering with the East End Cooperative Ministry and also a, a company in the North Hills um, called Abrams Nations who do sewing and have idle sewing machines and so we're able to put people back to work on those machines. Some of my friends who are dentists or whatever they would call, well thanks for making the shields and I made sure that our company actually donated to a metal, local medical center near uh, our uh, facility. So it was good and they were very appreciative to get that equipment. Members can expect to receive their face coverings through June and July. Highmark also donated 40,000 cloth face coverings to EMS providers last month during National EMS Week. We want to make sure that they have you know, the appropriate face coverings so that, you know, um, eliminate or reduce some of the stress that they're under and you know make them feel more comfortable when they're out in public or you know back to work. Really great story and thanks to everyone involved in this. By the way, Little Earth Productions, which is located on the south side, says they're looking for more help and sewers for this project. So if you want to help them, they want to hear from you. It's truly a Pittsburghers Helping Pittsburghers initiative and we love that. And as always, thanks to Highmark Blue Cross Blue Shield, together with Allegheny Health Network, for sponsoring today's story and all our Eye on Health segments right here on PTL.